Welcome to the Storyteller Channel. In this chapter, we delve into a realm where the air shimmers with an unsettling energy. The landscape is ever-changing, shifting from vibrant festival hues to muted tones that whisper of fears yet to be confronted. Haunted houses loom in the distance, their windows dark and foreboding, while twisted trees reach out with gnarled branches, as if to ensnare the unwary. Join Evelyn, Marcus, and Finn as they navigate this mysterious world, each drawn by their own personal dread, a siren call that beckons them deeper into the shadows. Stay tuned as we unravel the mysteries of this chapter. Evelyn, her heart racing, steps forward, her curiosity igniting a spark of bravery. She has always loved stories, weaving them from the threads of her imagination. But now she faces a challenge that demands more than mere words. The first house, its door ajar, seems to beckon her with a whisper of adventure. As she crosses the threshold, the air thickens, and the walls pulse with a heartbeat of their own. Inside, the darkness is alive, swirling with the echoes of tales untold. Evelyn feels the weight of her own storytelling ability pressing against her chest, urging her to create a narrative that could unlock the door to her fears. She knows that this is more than just a story. It is a journey into the heart of her own courage. Meanwhile, Marcus stands frozen at the edge of the realm, his wide blue eyes reflecting the chaos that erupts around him. Shadows dance and twist, taking on forms that mirror his deepest anxieties. A shadowy figure emerges, its features indistinct yet hauntingly familiar, embodying the fears that have haunted Marcus since childhood. He can feel the familiar grip of anxiety tightening around him, but this time, he is determined to confront it. With a deep breath, Marcus steps forward, his heart pounding like a drum, ready to face the embodiment of his fears. He knows that this confrontation is necessary, a step towards freeing himself from the chains of his past. Finn, ever the jester, attempts to lighten the mood with a quip, but the laughter feels hollow against the backdrop of their trials. As he ventures into a darkened corner of the realm, he finds himself surrounded by shadows that echo his own insecurities. The laughter that usually comes so easily to Finn falters, revealing the cracks in his facade. He realizes that humor, while a shield, cannot mask the deeper pain that lurks beneath. Yet, in this moment of vulnerability, Finn discovers a new strength, a way to channel his humor into a source of resilience. He understands that true courage lies not in hiding from one's fears, but in facing them head-on.